With sounds of the didgeridoo playing in the background, people gathered outside the Fleet Science Center to watch the solar eclipse today. We saw a solar eclipse right here in San Diego and at the Fleet Science Center, we decided to throw a huge watch party so that we could share the science with everyone in San Diego. I'm here to watch uh, my very first solar eclipse. And we're out here just you know, doing outreach for a very rare solar event. Hey, what's going on? I am Dee Slavecki. It's October 14th, 2023. I'm here in Balboa Park, right here in San Diego, California, watching the solar eclipse, a partial solar eclipse. People came here for a solar eclipse party this morning. I came to check it out. Follow me. There was a marine layer this morning, and we were a little nervous that we wouldn't be able to see the show. And then magic of nature, out came this ray of moon to cover the light, and we got to watch a really amazing experience. The solar eclipse sightseers wore protective glasses and witnessed the phenomenon through different telescopes at the party. From 8 to 10, we hosted the event. We had astronomers from different places here in San Diego with their telescopes. So you can talk to them, you can ask them any questions. Jake, an astrophysics student at UCSD, was working on one of the telescopes here. The sun moves actually pretty fast, so we're just adjusting it, just tiny amounts every single time the, as the sun moves across the sky. And he was happy to share the close-up view with people. It's really fun. There's a lot of people that came out. We had, you know, lines of people and, uh, you know, everyone's just really happy to you know, see something incredibly beautiful. The partial solar eclipse was visible for many Americans today. The west coast of America basically got to see this one. We're not in the region of totality or like the, the part where you see like the ring of fire that everyone's talking about. We're like out in the periphery, so we just get a partial solar eclipse. Here. Experts say it's the last of its kind over the Americas until 2046. I felt the need to just kind of stay until that moon went away for the very last second. Reporting from the solar eclipse party in front of the Fleet Science Center. It was phenomenal. I'm Jason Lebecki.